other uh, characters here, I'll introduce in a second. And, and it's just great to see somebody here to celebrate this day. And to celebrate with Jeb, Mr. Steering, with the Chamber of Commerce, with the Little League, and everyone that, that patronizes the restaurant. So, real briefly, um, it, it, it's, it's, a, it's a really great day in South Milwaukee to see such a long standing business um, make a significant investment in South Milwaukee. Um, and this is one of the earlier McDonald's in the area. It's just family started this, his dad, with the Cudahy location. This came on not long after that. This is 1969. 1969. Wow. And, and to see this level of commitment since then to South Milwaukee and shown today through the massive, the significant renovation you see here with the, the technology upgrades, the look and feel, all of this, and to see them reinvent themselves this way and choose to do it in South Milwaukee is a terrific thing and it's something I'm proud of here, something we all should be proud of across the city. And we also, I think more importantly, should be proud of all the great community work that Jeff does um, and support for all different activities. Um, it's really exactly a, a perfect example, a best practice example of how communities, can, how businesses can support the communities they're in. I thank you for that. And specifically the Little League and South Milwaukee Little League adults here today. There's, some money for them. Um, I'll uh, introduce Bob Lubetsky uh, here for the South Milwaukee Little League. He might say a few words in a second. Um, I also have uh, Leah Mandy, the owner of Parkway Floor, along with the president of the South Milwaukee Community Business Association, and obviously Jeff. Uh, but again, we'll, I'll just throw over to Leah here in a second for a couple quick words. But again, my congratulations to you and thank you and thank you all for being here and being a part of what we're doing here. In, in redeveloping South Milwaukee and, 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 and seeing that large investment you're making, it's outstanding to see. Um, Leah, why don't you say a few words? Um, again, Leah Manby from the South Milwaukee Community and Business Association. I would like to, on behalf of the South Milwaukee Community and Business Associ Association, also known as our Chamber of Commerce, uh, thank you for your continued membership over the years and your continued support throughout the community in general. Um, this is a beautiful renovation and I want to congratulate you for unveiling this to us today. Um, yeah. um, Bob, Bob's here from the South Milwaukee Little League, and he's been such a strong supporter of this, and I'm about to talk about that a little bit. It's huge. Um, I've been involved with Little League for the last decade, and McDonald's has always been a part of it. Um, Mr. Stern was our Grand Marshal last year in the parade, and as I said during that time, our rookie ball program is the foundation of our Little League, which has been around since 1954. McDonald's and Mr. Steren sponsored the entire rookie ball program. We could not support our rookie ball program without the support of McDonald's. It's huge, it's great, and like Mayor Brooks said, it really shows how businesses in our community can help support programs in our community and make it even stronger. It's awesome that we have all these little kids here from our rookie ball program to be part of it, because they're going to see how it's done. And hopefully when they're growing up and, and moving on and everything stays the way we have it here. I can't thank you guys enough for everything you've done for us. It's been just phenomenal. And we're very blessed and lucky to have you guys in the relationship we have. I brag about it with the other presidents. They're jealous of the relationship we have with businesses in our community. But none bigger than this one here. So thank you so much. Appreciate it. Okay, my, my, my turn. You know, we try to be good citizens uh, in our 50, you know, 50 years basically in the community. You know, or even we were supporting things like the spectacle music back in the mid-60s before we were here. Yeah. Yeah, it was from the cut, the cut of the store uh, that used to be in Factory Plaza. This is our second building on this site because the original building was, was the parking lot over there. Oh, yeah. if, you, if you are old enough to remember those kind of things. That, that was that building when this building went up. It's been remodeled more times than I care to count. And you know, this one now is kind of updating as McDonald's evolves into the 21st century, whether you know delivery delivery business through Uber, whether it's you know kiosk store or order on a touch screen, whether it's you know, using a mobile app to get you know on your phone to get you know food waiting for you when you pull up. I mean, it's just there's too many ways to order. And unfortunately, you know, kind of too confused. It's just the old guys like me who get confused when you have to figure that out. But yeah, if I can help the Little League, if I can you know, help you with the Air State Parade, you know, whether it's one event or another, you know, you know, we try to say thanks to the communities that have been there for us for most of my life. So thank you all for being here.
special ribbon, what does the ribbon signify? Okay. The if I'm going to cut a ribbon, I might as well you know, help someone. So, you know, we said, well, let's, let's benefit fully. You know, I haven't done much design in the last you know, few months, so. And they've made me a pretty much not once, but twice in the last, last say, five or six years, which is a, a real honor. And I, it's an excuse to you know, run my 57 Chevy somewhere. <laughs> so, anyway, you know, the, cur the currency that's on the ribbon that we get to cut will go to them today. Okay. Do you want to cut a ribbon? Do it. Let's do it.